for the next survival guide. Next survival. I'm done. We're done. This is the last. This is the last tip. We're done. We don't need any more. But Zach. The winter. What the fuck did you just do? Tune in tomorrow. So here are some tips I use to survive the winter. How did we get here? How, what are we doing here? What the hell? First, you want to protect yourself from the elements. If you're smart and plan your excursion, you wear warm clothing. Plan? We just poofed here. Like, what do you mean? What the fuck? Why is mine all fucked up? That's not an exact science. It's not a science. Yeah, not to you. Anyways, the next thing you're going to want to do is build a nice warm fire. Fire keeps you from getting hypothermia, and it keeps off predators. If you don't have one, you're liable to succumb to the elements and become food for the Wendigo. I'm sorry, Wendigo? Yeah, these are his woods. Well, normally they're his woods when I'm here, they're my woods. He knows that. He? It. They? I guess Wendigo would be non-binary, right? Who are you? First, you'll want to lay down Tinder. Tinder? What do you do, like swipe right for warmth? I'm sorry, I'll stop. Thank you. <sighs> Anyways, tinder is a very flammable substance like hay or leaves or dried grass, something that'll light easily. Next, on top of that, you'll need to put down kindling. Small sticks that you gather that will burn faster and hotter to keep the logs of the fire warm so they'll eventually catch. The more kindling, the better. Finally, on top of that, you'll put your logs. Or if you can't come across logs in the wilderness, use large sticks and keep a steady supply. Stack your logs in a teepee style around the kindling. This gives plenty of oxygen for the fire to breathe. There, now isn't that warm? I mean, not really, we haven't really lit it yet, it's just a pile Next, of Next, you're gonna wanna find food and water, because starving to death in the woods and eating one's friends is how one becomes a Wendigo in the first place. And I am hungry. It's in the video. It's in the video. Uh, oh, oh. <clears throat> yeah, of course. Um, so the first thing you're going to want to do is find water, though, because you can live for three weeks without food, but only one week without water. So, in order to avoid dehydration, you just... Just get some snow. Duh. Where did you... No. No, you idiot. That brings down your core body temperature and leaves you liable to get hypothermia. Where did you even find snow? Hmm. Why is there only a single pile... You know what? Never mind. I don't know why I'm the one questioning this. All right, no, what you want to do instead is first, you take your water bottle and you pack it full of snow, or if you can't find snow, ice, like so. And then what you do is you stick it inside of your coat. That way it melts so that it becomes water. Lucky for me, I run hot, so it never takes it long to melt. How hot are you? Let's not talk about how I got all the weird knowledge I have. Now that you have water, it's time to find food. Non-human, right? I mean, I, I guess. Vegetation is sparse in the winter, but lucky for you, there's a myriad of tiny woodland creatures that taste delicious if you don't think about it. I thought about it. There are a ton of ways with which to dispatch your dinner. Some people like to use sharpened sticks. Other people use a bait and trap method. I myself prefer something far more efficacious and just a touch more immediate. You've had that this whole time? I never don't have it. So all you have to do is find yourself a lovely woodland creep. There, Zach, Zach, do you see it? Yeah, I think it's a, oh, it's a little bunny. Oh man, I bet it'll be delicious. Oh, the bunny. Delicious. How did you get that? You saw it. No, 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 I saw you kill a bunny, pick it up, turn around, and now you have stew. Yeah, see, you saw. Okay, all right, all right, fine, fine. What about, what about, I don't know, shelter, smart guy? Oh, shelter, yeah, that. Uh, yeah, for that, you just, uh, just go inside. What the? Oh, that son of a bitch, every goddamn time! She's pretty good, though. Bye, I guess. Hello? Anybody?
everybody. Yeah.